are so amazing, aren't they? Can you imagine being able to soar across the sky and look down at Earth? Of all the many kinds of animals, only birds can fly. How can they do this? It is because they have wings and feathers. Their bodies are perfect for flying. Birds also have two legs and a beak. They build nests and lay eggs. Let's learn about some common birds. Cardinal. A cardinal is a passerin bird. There are many kinds of passerin birds. A passerin bird has three toes facing forward and one toe facing backward when it sits on a branch. Cardinals live in North and South America. They like to eat seeds. They have very strong bills, and they live in forests and in neighborhoods of small towns. A male cardinal is more brightly colored than a female cardinal. Eagle. There are about sixty different kinds of eagles. Eagles live on all of Earth's continents except Antarctica. These continents include Africa, Asia, Australia. Europe and North and South America. All eagles are birds of prey. This means that they hunt and eat other animals. An eagle is a powerful bird with a big, strong beak, and it can fly fast. A female eagle is larger than a male eagle. An eagle's nest is called an eyrie. Falcon. A falcon is another bird of prey, like an eagle. Birds of prey are known for their excellent eyesight. There are thirty-seven different kinds of falcons, and they live on all of Earth's continents. The peregrine falcon is a famous kind of falcon. It can fly as fast as two hundred miles per hour. This makes it the fastest-moving animal on Earth. When people train falcons on how to hunt, this is called falconry. Heron. A heron is a kind of bird with long legs, a long neck, and a long bill. There are sixty-four different kinds of herons, and they can be black, blue, brown, gray, or white in color. They live on all the continents except Antarctica. Herons are called water birds, but they cannot swim. They live on the edges of lakes, ponds, swamps, rivers, and seas, where they look for food. They like to eat things like fish, insects, and reptiles. Kingfisher. A kingfisher is a small, brightly colored bird with a large head, a long, sharp bill, and short legs. Kingfishers live in many places around the world, but they mostly like to live in warm tropical areas and often in forests. Many kingfishers live near rivers and lakes. This is because they like to eat fish. But there are also many that live away from the water, like birds of prey. Kingfishers have very good eyesight. Lark. Like the cardinal, a lark is a passerin bird. Larks live mostly in Africa, Asia, and Europe, but there is one kind that lives in North America: the horned lark. Larks are known for the beautiful songs that they sing while they are flying. Their brown feathers serve as camouflage. The color of their feathers blends in with the background. This helps to hide them when they are on the ground. Robin. There are two kinds of robins: European robins and American robins. Both kinds have reddish orange feathers on their chests and bellies. They look a little bit alike, but they come from two different families. The American robin is a member of the thrush family. They are passerine birds that migrate south during the winter. Robins are songbirds. When they return, we can hear their song, and it means that springtime is here. Seagull. Seagulls are also called just gulls. They are seabirds, but they don't fly very far out over the ocean. They wade along the shore looking for lunch. Their favorite things to eat are fish and crabs. 
Gulls are usually gray or white and have webbed feet. Seagulls are known for being noisy birds. They make their nests together in groups called colonies. You can imagine all the squawking that goes on in large colonies of seagulls. Starling. Starlings are passerine birds that live mostly in Africa, Asia, Australia, and Europe. There are some that live in North America. Some kinds of starlings that live in Asia are called minor birds. They can be noisy, just like seagulls. In Africa, they are called glossy starlings because their feathers are very shiny. They are strong flyers. They like to eat fruit and insects, and they lay blue. Or white eggs. Stork. Storks are a bit like herons. They have long legs, long necks, and long bills. In fact, they are related to herons, except that storks usually live in drier areas than herons. A stork is mute. This means it cannot make sounds in its throat. How can they talk to each other? They do something that is called bill. Clattering. They make sounds by quickly opening and closing their bills. They eat. Vulture. A vulture is a bird of prey, like an eagle or a falcon, but it is a special kind of bird of prey. It is a scavenger. This means that it flies high overhead in the sky and from above. It looks down, trying to find carrion. Which means dead animals. There are two kinds of vultures: those that live in Africa, Asia, and Europe, and those that live in North and South America, like the giant condors in the Andes Mountains. Warbler. A warbler is a passerine bird that is usually small and eats insects. There are so many kinds of warblers, and they often look very much alike. This sometimes makes it difficult to tell one kind of warbler from another. But they are songbirds, and each kind of warbler sings its own unique song. Sometimes listening to the song that it is singing is the only way to tell one kind of warbler from another.